Hey everybody, welcome to the show. I am the Fire Escape Griller, and yes, I eat a lot of burgers, and I eat a lot of barbecue, and I do drink quite a bit of beer. So to make up for a lot of that, I like to forego dessert. I almost never have dessert. So when I do have dessert, I want it to be really, really good. Today on the Fire Escape, I'm going to show you how to make a really, really good dessert using grilled pineapple. Okay, so here we have a lovely pineapple. This is a local pineapple, local to New York. I'm just kidding, this is from Costa Rica. We don't have pineapples in New York. And what you wanna do is cut the top and the bottom off of this thing so that it sits nicely on your cutting board. The next thing we wanna do is take the rind off the pineapple. You just wanna run your blade right inside that prickly skin and just cut that rind right off. Once you've removed the rind, you want to lay the pineapple on its side, take your knife and cut into slices about a half an inch thick. And for those people watching outside of the United States, that's about one and a quarter centimeters. And so here it looks like I'm getting eight slices. Next thing you want to do is take a paring knife, or this is actually a butter knife with a slightly serrated edge to it, and just go around the core of your pineapple slice, and then just pop that core right out of there. Do that same thing to all your pineapple slices, and we are ready for the grill. Out here I've preheated the Weber Q, and I'm going to take a paper towel and hold it with some tongs, Dip it in oil, and I'm using coconut oil, so I'm hoping that'll give it a nice little tropical flavor. And I'm gonna rub that on the grill grates because these pineapple slices do have a tendency to stick a little bit to the grill. Then add your pineapple slices to the grill, and we're gonna cook this on medium heat with the lid closed for about two to two and a half minutes until we get some nice grill marks. And now about two minutes has gone by and we're gonna check these for the grill marks. They're looking pretty good. Now you can't really see them when they're flipped totally over because of the bright sun today, but they're definitely there and they look great. So we're gonna close the lid again and give them another two minutes. So another two, two and a half minutes has gone by and we're gonna check these out. They are sticking a little bit to the grates. Ideally, you would use a spatula here, but I'm using tongs because it's easier for me to film it. But they're looking pretty good, so we're gonna bring them inside. Now we're gonna plate one up, and I don't know about you, but I think haagen makes the best vanilla ice cream. And just add a nice scoop of that vanilla ice cream right into the center where the core used to be. And we're gonna finish it off with some good honey, lightly drizzled over the top. How good is that? And here we have our final dish, grilled pineapple a la mode, made on a fire escape in Brooklyn, New York. Hmm. okay. This is like unbelievably good. The warm pineapple, with the cold ice cream, and then that nice little touch of honey at the end. It's so sweet, and the pineapple is nice and caramelized. This is definitely a keeper. Uh, definitely give this a try, and let me know what you think in the comments below. Leave a like, subscribe, and of course, keep on grilling. I should eat dessert more often. <laughs>